Hello, hello, hello. How's everyone go doing? Yeah. <laughs> so we should be going live in, well, now really. Hope everyone's doing good. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at everything, make sure that everything's working and running. And I am using something a like slightly different as well. So it should be pretty good, but if anyone can use the good old chat, that'd be awesome just to make sure that's all working. Um I haven't got I haven't obviously got the uh uh do hickey. Yeah, that doesn't really help. I haven't got uh, a webcam on today just because uh I've been trying to get my internet speed up a bit uh since moving. And so far, yeah. Not really be able to do much of it. And also I'm trying out the new OBS. So how's everyone doing? Is chat working? I haven't seen any messages come through yet. It's a bit of a shame. I can see there's a couple of people on. Oh well, um, so anyway, uh, what I'm going to be doing today anyway, because I can't, for some reason, the chat is not doing very well for me. This is very, very strange. There we go, so I can see the chat there. Very, very bizarre. So apparently, yeah, I cannot see the chat. Ah, oh, right, okay, so YouTube's changed it a little bit. Very annoyingly, YouTube has changed the chat, to the chat to pop out at least. So it was only super chats and... Um, Memberships show in, so that's why I couldn't see it, but don't worry, I've fixed it now. Um, so I've actually found the other button for the pop-out, which is really annoying. Anyway, so I'll just say hello to all of you guys. So we've got Wet Fox, uh, we've got Pink Bubble Snake, that's a different name. Uh, Andrew a Am uh, Emerson, Andrew Emerson as well. Um, Mark we we Weston, Mark Weston, Lucas Siaflas, Ziaf Siaflas, I think so. I think so, yeah. Go with that. Um, Jamie Adamson as well, Hammerhead, uh, Blue Chief, Devin Ware, it's got quite a few people, Alex Albus as well, how's everyone going? Well, how's everyone doing? You know what I mean, you know what I mean. Um, so shall I explain what we're actually going to be doing, um, <laughs> doing anyway, might help, might help a tiny little bit. So yeah, I've switched over to um, the OBS, uh, no sorry, OBS, Streamlabs version of OBS. So I don't know what the quality is going to be like, um, but I'm going to use normal OBS for recording and stuff, and it's really annoying switching between um, the kind of like stream modes and the normal modes a little bit, it's not that bad. So we're going to be building, essentially, some trees, which I know sounds really boring, but it's something that we can do while we just like sit down and just kind of like chill out a little bit, that's the main thing, we're going to be chilling out, and uh, yeah, just having a chat and seeing what's going on uh, and all that kind of stuff so I mean it's going to be pretty good but if you guys do have any questions that you want to ask me or anything like that or chat about um, feel free to uh, do that I'll try and pick them up sometimes it can get really busy though so uh, I do apologize if I do miss some because uh, yeah it does sometimes get really really busy and I, I just can't see them all so it all kind of like disappears and everything like that but we're going to be building some trees so I'm, I'm working on a new map for the Patreons and uh, as part of that I was like, actually, yeah, I'm going to, rather than using, like, tree packs that exist already, we're going to create some new trees and rocks and basically a stuff pack. So, um, yeah, it's going to be quite quite good. Um, it'll be up for download as well, so uh, once we're done, you can actually see it. At the minute, I'm in 1.12, but we will be, at some point, upgrading the server to 1.14. So that's a donated server. Uh, so we can, at least, you know, all of this will be absolutely fine, and then we can just upgrade it with any new stuff. I mean, I don't think there's going to be a lot. What the hell is that one? I like how he's used fence gates, a bit weird, but... Scott's Pine, ah, Scott's Pine, okay, fair enough. I don't know, it's different. Um, but yeah, we're going to be, you know, doing this and, and using all these trees on it. That is a really nice, really, really nice fern, I like that. Or fur, whatever it's called, uh, a Norway spruce, so really good. Um, right, so just to say hello to everyone else that's on here, we've got somebody that's just called themselves Minecraft, uh, Hoang and Hura. Hua, Huara. Not too sure how you do that one, but uh, how's it going? Uh, Adrian Sheldick as well. Sheldrick, sorry. Sheldrick. There we go. Il Pirata Sol Turbo as well. How's it going? Ah, from Italia. Buongiorno. And, um, yeah, I'm going to go to Italy actually next. 
next month? Yeah, it's next month that we're going to go to Italy. Uh, me and my other half are going to go to Italy. It's going to be quite cool. So I'm actually really, really looking forward to that. Now I've got to try and make another one of these, right? Oh my god. Oh no! My middle click's broke. Which is really weird, because it's a brand new mouse. Um, let me... Right, okay, middle click, we'll turn it to... No, not that one. Not that one. No, that one. Why has that got, like, complaining about stuff? I have no idea. Right, so at least I'll be able to do it at this, like, side button instead. Um, but yeah, gonna go to Italy in, uh, July. It's gonna be very, very cool, actually. That's not the one I wanted. That's really weird. Oh! <coughs> Why is it... What is happening? Sprint, left click. Oh. Sneak. Sprint. Control. Do, do one of those. I have no idea. Just, just do one of those. Weird. I'm actually surprised that he's used uh, that because I would have always thought spruce. But all right, I guess, I guess that's what we're going to use. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, the Irish Wonder as well. Uh, Mark Weston. How's it going? So I'm missing people. I do apologise, guys. I uh, got Jesse as well. Action for Ashton. Iron Zeki as well. Or Zeki. Um, Hoang. It says, I'm curious, when will you do a video on the Zeppelin airship? I have no plans to do a Zeppelin airship. Um, the tutorials are not doing well. Honestly, in, t in terms of like views and stuff like that, the actual... Um, basically, the ones that take the longest are really not doing well in terms of like views or anything like that. They're just not getting uh, much on there. And they, they take about... Well, they take about 20 times longer uh, to actually do. So I'm just on my other screen at the minute, just... Um, that's why I'm not doing anything on screen, just trying to get some good pictures of um, some of these Norway spruces. Ah, there we go, that's a nice one. Um, so yeah, they're not, they're not just, just not doing very well at the minute. Like, at all. Should I go for like a smaller one? I'm going to do like a smaller one, because otherwise, otherwise we're going to end up with all these big ones. I think the idea with this is that we have um, quite a few, so we've got like small ones there. How many small ones do you have per thing? So that's normal, normal Norway spruce, so wait a minute, so those are all Norway spruce, so we have four of those, and I'm guessing you get a load of large ones. Yeah, so those are all... So this is really weird, this hologram stuff. I love it, but um, it's really weird that um, when you merge plots, it still stays there. I need to have a look at that at some point. So yeah, it's a bit crazy. Um, so, what else we got? Harris Production, you got one of those nice ticks on your name. Always good to get verified. Um, did you have any sort of a, a nightmare getting verified, or was it not too bad for you? Because I had loads of problems with it. Loads and loads of problems with it. God, I'm going to have to get rid of it. used to uh, doing all that on the side. Uh, but yeah, I had loads of problems with actually getting verified. It's weird. I, I had to use, to actually use the live chat with the YouTube team in order to do it. Uh, but when I emailed them, they just asked me a load of really weird questions that had nothing to do with it. It was like, oh, what, what, what are you tax you paying in the US? And I was like, I'm not in the US. Well, how do you, how do you do it then with the UK? We need to see the US documents. It's like, what? And I went onto the live chat and they went, no, we just look at your channel and that's it. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's kind of what I was expecting. So really bizarre. Uh, but I think it's probably because they're just like, you know, they're just given a script really, aren't they? And they just kind of have to go with it. So if they misidentify it as something, then they're kind of a bit stuck. You know? Uh, Charlie Adamson, do I know what Updog is? No idea. No idea what that is at all. <laughs> oh, random one. But anyway, uh, Harris Productions, can you give you a link to link to download this map? It's a server. It's, we're literally on a server, so we're on a server, and it's just a plot a plot world. So obviously, um, no, because <laughs> it's not done. Uh, when it's done, there will be there'll be a download up, so that'll be fine. But you know, there's nothing there if you know what I mean like it's it's a it's literally a, a server in a plot world for donators uh, we've got Buzz Lately here as well ah right let me oh that does not look good see I'm gonna have to steal what Nick's done here because he's gonna like like really chunky bits on the sides so he's actually done his really chunky. He is a hell of a lot better at trees than I am. Good God. It's going to be a nice mixed pack, though. I think that's the... 
that's a good thing. But the idea being behind doing a, a pack in the first place, because some people might be like, well, why are you going to you know, bother doing a pack on a server anyway? Um, then people can use it on plots and things like that, so they can just go and grab some good quality trees, you know, and just copy them. Uh, it makes everything so much easier, and if you've got your own pack that you're kind of like doing, you just expand it as you go, you know? So there is that as well. Right, okay, so if we go for something like... I'll try and have a look at this. It's got a little bit of a curve at the minute, which I'm thinking now, actually, there could be a bit of its feature. You know, if we do it this, like, properly. Should we get some music on, anyway? Let me get some music on. I'll go and grab that. Um, so, we got the Drumstick Empire says, Do I like cheese? Of course I do. Doesn't everyone like cheese? Surely, surely everyone likes cheese. Well, the only thing is this might be a little bit loud in the, uh, thing. Let me just turn that down a little bit on, on new OBS. Um, but yeah, of course I do. Uh, favourite cheese is... Well, it depends. Like, um... It depends. If it's Christmas time and stuff like that, uh, Wensleydale and Cranberry is amazing. Like, seriously. It's just... It's one of those, like... You wouldn't have it all the time at all. It's like a Christmas thing, yeah? But that is... That is great. Absolutely great. I do not like this at all. What am I doing? Um, absolutely great tasting. And it's just different, you know? Uh, same with, like, spicy cheeses as well, they're pretty good, you know, ones that have got like chilli in, so pretty much anything that's got like extra flavours in it, I kind of seem to like quite a lot, so I'm just trying to, <laughs> it looks terrible <laughs> alright, okay, let me just uh, delete this, and uh, <laughs> well, there's no other way to get any other oak wood at the minute, is there? because I can't, uh, is there any problem with this? okay, let's undo that we will not do it, angles. <laughs> it's too small it's just too small, it's just not going to look right, um yeah, so pretty much any cheese that got like extra, like different flavors in them, I quite like my flavors and spices and things like that. So, it, you know, stuff like that really does help, I think, personally. Uh, no, I definitely need something in there, don't I? You know, if I don't have anything in there, uh, we need to make it. No, we do need to actually jump. You know, cut that out a little bit. Make it a little bit more lumpy, but not lumpy, just more sticky, outy. Ooh. leaves am I using? Just wondering, because I didn't grab them out of here, I grabbed them off a the next tree. I'm wondering if they actually are going to uh, fall apart. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure those ones, I'm pretty sure I had some on the side, didn't I? I don't know, maybe I can't remember. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Um, action for Ashton. Oh, I still, am I still making Star Wars builds? Yeah, if you've seen recently, me and me and Zaris uh, Plays did a Lars Homestead build. Uh, if you haven't caught that video, I do recommend you go and check that out. But that's that's like pretty damn recent. Um, recently, we did that. So yeah, we are, we're still doing them. Um, not doing it as much because uh, the, people just don't watch them. Um, there's not as many people that watch kind of like videos anymore uh, of that those kind of things like tutorials and stuff like that. Do not do as well. Um, the shaders tutorial, for example, has got about uh, in a time span, it's like the same as uh, six, you know five years of of doing like a big tutorial like that, and it's it's just like crazy, really. That doesn't look that bad. I just think I need to cut out a couple of little bits. Not that bit though. Mm, does that look like the tree? I don't really know. Bit weird. Bit weird. Uh, so we've got LGF has, after 12 days, completed the H-44 Super Battleship. Cool, man. Awesome. Yeah, that was, that was, um, I'll never do that again. Like, seriously, that, that just, that, doing that video was an absolute pain. Like, seriously a pain. Okay, that, yeah, that, I think we do need to cut something out, like, here or something. And then we can go, this one needs to maybe change. Hmm. And yes, this is how much effort I will put into making a tree. <laughs> Sometimes they just like take quite a while. So there we go, nice little one. Now I'm, I'm guessing Nick's putting his name on it. Yeah, I knew he'd do that. I just, I just knew he'd do that. Norway Spruce S O two. Okay. Because I think he's got his own um, coding system. <laughs> is what it seems like, anyway. Was it crazy? <sighs> uh, Pingo Community Channel. Whereabouts in Cornwall am I from? Uh, in Truro, actually. So it's, it's you know, good old, good old Truro. 
that's not that bad. You know, it's, it's not too bad in Truro. It's a, it's a nice place, I guess. Yeah, you know, we got the whole town thing. Um, but it's not too bad. I'm guessing that's the middle. I don't really know. Uh, but that kind of looks like the middle. Just to give me a nice starting plate, like point, really. So, I mean, Nick's done it that big. Should I do one that's bigger than his, just because we can? Maybe. Um, anyway, Jim games make like a tree that grows at like a 45 degree angle. Um, they just don't really do that. You, you'll you get some that are slightly curved. Um, it depends on... It depends on quite a few different things. Though. So you can have it like where it's got a lot of snow on it because of that is bent a little bit. And you'll get, get stuff, you know, like where uh, the sun's always hitting at one angle and therefore it's stretched in order to try and get as much sun. But you, you most likely wouldn't get one at 45 degrees. I can't imagine it happening anyway. That'd be really weird. Can you imagine it? Really weird. Uh, how much RAM on my PC? I've got uh, 64 uh, gig. Gig? Meg. No, gig. <laughs> I, I'm, problem is, right, I, I work in IT, so I'm used to, like... I think we've got about a terabyte. So whenever anyone asks me that, I'm like, wait, do, we have, do I have meg or gig? Or is it because I'm... like It's, it's like imagining um, thinking on a different scale. <laughs> Completely. Um, but you know, it's 64 gig that I've actually got. Yeah, so I've got a lot, but it's an, it's an older PC now, so it's actually... Um, it's actually over five years old now, as it's, it's crazy as that seems. So it's, it's struggling. Um, it is starting to struggle. But the main problem that I've got is... Uh, internet at the minute. I, I don't know why. It's just that, like, I've moved I've moved my desk into a different room, right? So you'd, you'd expect, ah, oh, that's absolutely fine. You know, it's just, all it's done is moved, right? But for some reason, the internet is just nowhere near as good here in this room. Um, so I've taken out my webcam. My webcam was plugged into my keyboard, which I know sounds really strange, but there's a um, really good quality kind of um, USB cable going from that. Um, and yeah, like, it's just not anywhere near as good. It's, it's really kind of a bit bizarre. I'm actually need to do that that way. So these are going to be roots, because what you'd end up having is, like, dirt and stuff around here. So I had to try and make, I'm trying to make, like, roots and stuff. And these, I think I'll end up painting them over, like, with the other texture, wherever it is. Uh, I'll, I'll figure it out later on um, to do that because we can just brush them so that would be pretty good ah, Hammerhead, can I go live more? Love this live stream so chill, thanks man um, yeah I do try to every so often, the problem at the minute is work um, so my work's quite, you know I'm, I'm basically a programmer um, and if you've ever been a programmer or done programming that kind of stuff. I actually think this is going to be a, this is going to be too much. Just having a look at it. I might need just a couple bits. Um, but if you've yeah, if you've ever done any sort of like programming work, it's quite it's quite um, intensive. Uh, so you're like your brain is like Bleh, by the end of the day. Um, <laughs> it's the only way to really explain it. So that's kind of like my problem at the minute. I've had just a huge amount of work to do, and because of that. I've just been exhausted. I've always always be streaming quite a lot because at the minute I haven't got too many videos that I'm like working on because I'm working on the uh, big world painter map for the Patreon stuff. I'm gonna end up um, yeah because I'm working on that more than anything. I haven't got any like videos that I'm doing or any builds that I'm doing because uh, I want to get that map done so that well the Patreons and and me can all just start building stuff. So um, well, that's the main main kind of like thing that I want to do. Yeah, we're definitely gonna make this bigger than the next one. <laughs> for no reason other than we can. Um, right, so they do have like little tree arms coming out, don't they? Like they're, they're like a lot smaller, aren't they? You know, like they're not huge, maybe. I don't want to do them like totally at an angle though. I want to. Yeah, that's better. Like something like that. Yeah, little one there. Another one there. Alright, then maybe like that. So cut that one back. It's a really, really 
basic frame. Uh, there. Yeah, something like that. Uh, Dream Game, you need to pay for Patreon, right? Yes, so Patreon is a way to... Um, essentially, it's like... Um, so, actually, I'll, I'll explain how, how the whole YouTube thing works and stuff. So, YouTube, um, what you basically do is you get paid from AdSense. So, AdSense is your adverts that come up. Um, and... That's kind of it, really. <laughs> no, but... Um, so, yeah, you get paid from adverts. Uh, it's not very much. It's, like, quite a, quite a little bit. For those that are English, it's about a pound for every thousand views, but it totally varies. Like, every every day is slightly different. You know, weekends are a little bit more, and um, it also depends on, like, the actual time of year, Christmas. Of course, there's more adverts out, and people, more, more people are willing to... Well, more companies are willing to pay a higher price price on adverts at Christmas time for the obvious reason that uh, well more people are in the they're going to they're gonna be buying so you know you want to try and capture them as much as possible so Christmas goes up um, it's not a lot of money so um, it's not enough to work off of so for example my full time job I get 30,000 uh, it's about 30,000 pounds a year is my current salary uh, and that will be due to go up to 32 next year which will be awesome uh, so it's not you know it's not too bad it's, it's quite a good salary I'd say um, in terms of YouTube um, actually, this month I've done a lot better. I've been earning three hundred pounds uh, this month, which is is a hell of a lot more than I've been earning um, for quite a while, actually. So that is that is a huge bonus, um, and it's due to those two shader videos that I've done the the shader installs. Definitely is because of those, uh, without a doubt, because I can see the stats on those and stuff. So anyway, um, yeah, it's it's not a lot of money, uh, but what I'd like to do is you know. Um, in order to make like more content and do more building and stuff like that, and also build with people is one of the things I really want to do. Um, I've set up a Patreon. Uh, Patreon allows you to pledge some money to me, so you can. It's basically like uh, donating every month uh, if you've never done it. Um, but yeah, you get to get to basically, you know, it would be a way to support me. So if I get to seven, I think it was seven hundred and fifty dollars a month, uh, I'll be able to actually drop one day at work. Uh, which means that I can spend one whole day every week, um, basically just uh, just doing Minecraft stuff and just chilling out on the server and chilling out with you guys, which I think would be really cool. Uh, so that's why I've kind of gone with Patreon, just because it allows you to do that. Um, and of course, because of doing that as well, that means that some of the funding that's coming in uh, via that, uh, at the minute, uh, all of that is going towards the server costs. So it's pretty cool. Hey, Serena Capuchin, how's it going, man? I'm building some Nord uh, Norway spruce things at the minute. I've got a small, tiny little one. I don't know about it. It needs some tweaking. It's, it's little and looks a little bit fat, so um, I think I'm just knocking out that one there kind of made it look a little bit better, actually. See, I'm still not sure about it. It's a bit like... Bleh. I think maybe that one as well. I don't like that. I think we're actually getting somewhere now that I'm looking at it again with fresh eyes. So yeah, how's it going, Nick? Yeah, it's all doing good. I just thought I'd finally get on and do some of these trees, because I'm getting to that point with the map, actually, that I can do it. But yeah, Patreon, um, you can then support me, and you'll get uh, access to the server, and um, when we get on to the main building, it's actually going to be a Patreon world. So that that main world is going to be my main world, it's kind of like for a series, in uh, using just vanilla. Uh, so I've chosen to go back to vanilla, which means you can't use the arrow in, or Ozodacris, or anything like that, because they're all... Uh, even modded, or they're using metadata, and it'd be complicated as hell to do anything else. Um, but, yeah. Um, yeah, it allows you to do that, and, uh, and we can actually start building at the minute. Uh, if you donate with anyway as well, by the way, guys, um, you'll get access to the plot side of the server, which is actually we're on plots right now. Um, so there is also that, and that's just like literally if you did a super chat of whatever, like, it doesn't really matter. Um, same with people that if they're a Patreon for, say, like, uh, well, anything over a month. After that, if they decided not to continue supporting me via Patreon, it's not a problem. They would still retain the donator rank on, um, what's it called, Discord, and also on the server as well. So they'd still have access to plots and stuff like that. It'd just be the the custom world that they wouldn't do. So, I mean, it's not actually that bad. Uh, and at the minute, what I'm doing, as you probably saw with the video of birds, uh, awesome, awesome build, which is Riverhold. 
uh, what I decided to do with that is um, we're doing like videos. So everyone that's a Patreon who's built something, um, uh, they can actually do like a video with me. So I'm I'm trying to do some bits and bobs at the minute with uh, with that kind of side of things, uh, which I think is quite interesting. Actually, I think it kind of like works as well. It's quite a nice quite a nice thing and I get to see a lot of builders and it gets people excited again which is always good because it's always difficult with like a game like this uh, with Minecraft is because people get like um, they don't get bored of it they just get um, uh, like you know exhausted of it and it gives them a little bit of a, a boost I think so they can see you know look back in a couple of years and go actually yeah we did I did build this really cool thing and it's on there as a YouTube video and um, they get the download as well you can download everything so it's pretty good there we go. Right. Anyway, sorry, missing stuff. Um, Serena Capuchin, what do you think of mine? It looks alright. We need variation. Yeah, we do. Yeah, yeah. We need lots and lots of variation. Well, to be fair, Nick, we we just need this whole place to be filled. <laughs> You've got so much to do. All right. <laughs> I expanded it as well, so I added in these four plots up here and these three plots on the side. So um, the area now is just absolutely monstrous. Oh, that's this one. I haven't seen these ones actually. Oh, I like the roots on those. Oh, they look good. I like them. Are they really going to go into the ground, though, with the fences as well? Or Damn. It's crazy. But, I don't know. Those look really good. Are these yours, Nick? Or are they... Yeah, they are yours. Oh, look at those. Alaskan... God, Alaskan cedar trees. All right. All right. Fancy, fancy, fancy stuff. Ah, uh, so... Nick, you've gone and uh, yeah, gonna go travel, packing right now to Spain in the morning. Really, you did uh, you did like one of the short term kind of like things. So we're going to Italy next month. It's gonna be it's gonna be awesome. We've got ten days, Rome, uh, Florence, and then Venice. So that's gonna be very very cool. I'm, I'm actually really looking forward to it. Except the pickpockets in Rome, of course. <laughs> Oh man, that's literally everything, and everyone's gonna. Yeah, Rome really looks nice. Uh, quite a bit of graffiti around, and uh, you're gonna get you're gonna get um, your stuff stolen off you while it's in your pockets because uh, the pickpockets are all around. So, oh, oh, okay. Um, thanks. <laughs> Damn. But yeah, no, there's nothing you can do about it. So that'd be that'd be really cool. Actually, I'm really I'm really looking forward to doing that. That'd be awesome. So. Staring at this tree. I need to chunky it up a little bit at the bottom. Yeah, I need to make this a little bit thicker and stuff. Problem is, I'm not used to doing like the pine tree type stuff, so I don't know why I chose this as the first thing. But, uh, yeah. We'll see. We'll get onto some other ones later on. These are not my not my forte at all. So, what can I see? Uh, I just wanted to say, uninspired, that is exactly what you say. Yeah, you get burnt out. Absolutely, you've, you're totally understanding what I was saying a little bit earlier. Totally, 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 yeah. Um, it totally happens, though. It's just, it just happens. I think that, like that's happened to me, I know, a couple times. Um, so I'm hoping that, you know, doing server stuff, um, working on, like, other projects with people, that always helps, you know? Because if, if you run, like, you go, oh, God, I haven't got any ideas, and they go, well, we'll give this a go, and let's just start building it, and you just start chatting and just chilled out and everything. Then, um, then it all kind of starts to work from there, doesn't it? All right, it's chunky out this side now. I have a really random way of doing this. I'm not really too sure if I even have a method. I think I'm just like placing some blocks and kind of seeing if that works. <laughs> so I guess is a is a method, isn't it? <laughs> it's not a very good one. That's a little bit better. So I've got a nice little slope on here. So somehow I've got these like natural like bits. <laughs> I don't really know how I've done it. So I really didn't intend to. I'm going to just knock that one out there. Oh, man. That's not looking too bad. What? There's only like, uh, what, 90, maybe 100 to do? <laughs> oh, man. This is, this is going to take a little while to do, but actually it's going to be so worth it. And also it's a fresh pack. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but... Um, I've been getting bored of like the other tree packs. It's almost like you know you need to have a ton of them in order to make everything, you know, work and look good and stuff, stuff in general, just stuff. Right, actually, put that one underneath there. That'd be pretty good. Uh, Game Game is maybe something like Hermitcraft, but with Lord Dacker and patrons. Um, yes, we well, 
Hermit Craft, I've not really watched any of it, but I know of it, if that makes sense, because it's, you know, it is a big damn thing, you know, really big thing. Um, but we will be having a survival server, so that will be for the patrons, because we've now got, uh, I think we've got four or five patrons at the minute, um, which means that, you know, it's, it's quite easily paid for the creative server, so I'm actually going to get a survival server, but I'm going to do the upgrade of the creative server to 114 first, I think. Um, I was holding back on upgrading it, because, um, basically because of the replay mod, but I'm kind of like thinking, actually, there's so much in 114, especially as a, as a version, uh, which is really good. So I want to, I want to really start using that, especially when we get onto the custom world. Um, it's just, you know, it's one of those things that we just, you know, got to do, even though, um, even though I won't be able to do the, the cooler time lapses, it'll be, you know, second account time time lapses. Um, it'll still be pretty good. See, Nick, Nick says a lot of Thicker than mine. Have a lot thicker than mine. I think it's just because he goes out a lot more. I think mine's a lot more slimmer, you know? Mine was supposed to be bigger than Nick's. <laughs> oh, damn it. Oh, well. Uh, Mr. Smiley, trees are your nemesis. Ah, oh, well, that's, that's another reason why we're building the pack, so people can just come here and copy and paste them on the server. <laughs> Because it's one of those things, you, you know, I'm I'm more interested in the stuff that you guys can make, or, or don donators can make, should I say, um, rather than all this other stuff. So, I mean, this kind of helps. And it also helps me, like us as well, that are going to be doing all the creative stuff. I can just teleport over here, grab a load of stuff, and uh, and we're off, really, you know. Let's get that one to go down like that. Um, does that even look like a thing? Hmm. Ah, so Kaputin's saying he got bags stolen out of uh, his rent card, so um, girlfriend's brother did that. Had that. I know, that's the, that's the main thing. So I'm looking at all these things on Amazon now. <laughs> like belts that actually are, like hide wallets and all that stuff. My girlfriend's like getting really into all of that. It's interesting. Fartface says, my sunglasses got stolen in Florence. Luckily, I am cheap, and uh, I've got a one-pound pair of uh, Primani <laughs> sunglasses. So if they get stolen, that's not a problem. I can just go and get more. So. Uh, Spiral tree would look fun, especially as a separate biome only tree. Yeah, maybe. Don't like that bit. I think it's that. I think it's that bit that I don't like. I don't like that even more. Maybe it's this bit I don't like. One of those blocks I didn't like, and I'm not really too sure which one it is. Doesn't look that bad. Just thinking, do we need to? Sticking it up on a couple bits. You can definitely see like the middle of mine a lot more. I don't know. Hmm. Ah, so Nick, you got a totally different technique to me. See, I I always place all the branches and stuff first, and then then like usually remove a couple branches because um, I put too many. Always, always put too many in. Uh, let's go for there. There. That's better, yeah, that looks better. Okay. It does kind of look like uh, one of these Nor Norway pines. If not, it's a pine. <laughs> oh. Glad to hear um, I'm London's. N in London's not only the place to uh, say Primani. No, I'm pretty sure it's. A, I think it's just a British thing, isn't it? We just say Primani. <laughs> it's got to be. Right, okay, that, that'll do. That's not that bad. You know, do I need to actually do this though to match Nick's? Well, that was weird. Or well, does that look stupid now? Did it look better before? <laughs> I think it might have actually looked better before. Surprising. No, 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 wait, I did. What did I do? I did that. Then that, then that, didn't I? No, maybe that does look a little bit stupid. Maybe that does look stupid. Let's go for that. All right, that's not bad. <laughs> I'm gonna go with that's not bad. 
Alright, oh, okay. Hey, Swedish Dr. Plastic. Good to see you, my man. Um. Oh, what, um, what's it called? Uh, FOV, is that what you mean? Uh, I usually go for 90 because of, like, medieval interiors rather than the old 70. I always find that 70 is, like, you're really close. You're like, whoa, there's a block, there's a block, there's a block. I always feel it's, like, really close. Uh, whereas 90, you are that close, but at least you feel like you're a little bit further away, if you know what I mean. Like, it's, I, I don't know. I just I always done it. Um, actually, I, I did it because of Jamsy Boy, actually, uh, thinking of it. The original time was actually when Jamsy Boy said about doing it. It was for uh, interiors and stuff like that. Ah, oh, these gold blocks. I now understand why the gold blocks are for. L Lodge pole pine. No, I'm not doing a pine. No, 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 no. What are these things? These are bushes, aren't they? We haven't got any bushes yet. We've got rocks. Don't know if I want to build rocks in a minute. We need more trees than anything else. Well, that looks okay. We've done two. Could do with a little bit more tweaking, but... Uh, Generally, it's not that bad. Actually, they are Norway pines. Actually, can I have a look at them? I'm just having a look at my pictures again. Norway pines are actually quite thick-leaved from the from the look of it. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. 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 It does does look quite thick-leaved. So let's try. Even if we just add in a couple, especially down the bottom as well. I want this bit here to go down. There we go. We'll get that. Uh. Dark green is coniferous tree. A light green are deliciouss. Oh, or deciduous. I, I always say deliciouss. I don't know why. I always say it the first time. I go, no, it's wrong. <laughs> deciduous. <laughs> Every single time. It's really weird. It's like my, my brain is like wired to say it. But yeah, that's fine. I'll go on to those then <laughs> once I can... I think I can do a bit better of job of. I mean, this hasn't... It hasn't turned out that bad, to be fair. Um, and I have no idea about the roots. I can't remember the damn ID for this to turn it into a... You know, the rounded thing? I can't remember. What is it? 1712 or something? Is it that? 1712... Alright, apparently I can remember it. Um, so completely ignore me then. Thank God for that. Right, there we go. I know some of them will be different directions, all that kind of stuff. It doesn't really matter at the minute. There we go. And then we can do the same up here as well on this one. There we go. Look at that. Bang. I have no idea how I remember these IDs. Uh, James Games. Oh, so you're having a look at the executive rank for the twenty-five, um, twenty-five dollars it is. Um, don't worry about the. Oh, wow, these look really green. I think it's because of this, isn't it? Um, yeah, don't worry about the twenty-five dollars. No one's doing that at the minute. That's more for people that have got YouTube channels that want like a boost. So say if they got a YouTube channel, they got like hundred. Oh, willows. Ooh. Ooh, I quite like a willow tree. I've never done one. So. Willow tree. Let's do a willow tree. Uh, I definitely need to type in willow tree because it's coming up with um, a midget. <laughs> Very strange. Uh, small willow tree. What do they look like when they're small? Are they are they the same? Dwarf. I don't know. Um, but yeah, don't have a look at the twenty-five dollar ones. I would go for the five dollar one. Um, but yeah, basically with that one at the minute, until we get any twenty-five dollar ones, um, they're kind of like the same. I know that sounds a bit strange, but. Uh, well, there isn't a. They won't have the the more private stuff, but the stuff like being a video type thing. Um, if you do the the Patreon roll, uh, the the five dollar one, uh, you can also be a member on on YouTube as well. It's the same thing. I've, I'm tying those both together, uh, even though the prices are slightly different. It doesn't really matter. It's the same kind of tier. Um, for either of those ones, you'll then get the Patreon rank and like like that uh, video I did with Bird uh, to show off Riverhold. It'll be the exact same thing. So. Uh, yeah, you know, feel free to do that. Oh, I need to 
realise I need to put my name on that one, don't I? Yeah, so when people delete it, they know that it was me that did it in the first place. Oh man, noise spruce. Oh, not Norwat. Norwat spruce. Oh, there we go. Um, so yeah, just go with that one. Uh, build something really cool. Uh, like You can do a plot if you want to. These are the size of the large plots. Even just any donator gets three of these plots, uh, surprisingly. So there's the Stainy Stands one that he built uh, the other day. I think he's doing something else now. Some Apparently some... Oh, he's doing, doing like a lunar thing, isn't he? He's doing some weird... I think he's lost it. <laughs> Who knows? Uh, the Irish wonder if the world is switched to survival will all those leaves despawn. Um, creative builder, but I don't. But I plan to play on survival on the world I'm building. They shouldn't do. Um, they shouldn't do. I mean, there's there's different um, data values for each of the leaves. So, like, if you pick them out of here, for example, uh, in the creative inventory, these ones do not despawn, right? Because you can just place them down there. They're absolutely fine. But if you get the other value of them, they will despawn. I can't remember what the data value is, but you can have a look at look at it up. I'm sure someone's got a video on it somewhere. Probably, or, or I was written a small article on it or something like that. Something like that. Um, right, so we were going to do... We're going to do a little willow tree. I have no idea what thing to use out of this, but they look... The only problem is always like trying to get a good picture that has the wood colour as well, I find. So, I mean, the little ones just look like normal ones, so I'm just going to look at a normal one. Same kind of thing. It also depends on the light as well, because some of these like look really dark. But it actually looks like oak wood again. <laughs> like oak log. I think it's always like oak log, isn't it? I just wonder, yeah, fences aren't that bad. It's one of those things that, you know, sometimes sometimes it looks good with them, uh, sometimes it doesn't. It's, um, it is just one of those things. You never really know. So what I'm going to do, this seems to go, oh, this is going to be really difficult, isn't it? Because I think I'm going to have to go to, like, there, or, or maybe even do the split from there and have, you know, a little bit here going out. This is going to be very difficult. Because they've got like... Obviously got quite a lot of branches on them. Like going out at all these different weird angles and stuff, so... Um, did I have it on the shovel? Is that what I used? Yeah. Apparently I just deleted that. Um, let's just do that. Put that there, put that there. Yeah, that looks horrible. That looks horrible. It's terrible. <laughs> oh god, uh put that in there. Put that on the side there. That would... God, it's so difficult. What I think this is why you build the bigger ones first. Hmm. Built a free tier maze <laughs> size on those plots. Good god, stilts. Oh man, that's crazy. Uh, TNL Gaming, my Conquest series is not cancelled right. It's kind of cancelled. Um, the reason, well, there's a couple of different reasons, uh, and I've spoken them, about them before, but a lot of the reasons are to do with it just being very. It just takes a long time to do a lot of stuff in Conquest, and it's because there's there's so much choice. You know, there's so much choice, and I'm sure Nick was saying something about these two. God, they really are the same texture, aren't they? That's just terrible. That's absolutely appalling, really, isn't it? That they, those two are the same. Good God. Right, I'm just going to throw these down here. No one else can delete them from me. <laughs> um, Willow, anyway. I think Willow actually looks... Actually, the jungle actually looks the most like it, because of the, um, the longer bits that can join together. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of those. Um, yes, yeah, so sorry, I was saying. So, uh, yeah, Conquest. So, yeah, Conquest is... Um, it takes a lot longer to do everything in Conquest, a hell of a lot longer. So actually making videos like Hamburg and stuff like that was just taking me... It was taking me like a month to do an episode, so it's just like ridiculous, really. Um, and the other problem is with Conquest is that there's not a lot of people that watch it. 
there is not a lot of people that watch it at all. Whereas for vanilla, um, there's so many more people. There's a ton more people, in fact. Uh, you know, like 10,000 more times, at least, well, and even more than that, probably probably about 100,000 times more people. So, I mean, in order for the channel to really survive, um, I have to go to vanilla. But I'm kind of, it's kind of, it's a bit weird, right? Because I always hated vanilla. I always hated, like, these textures and everything like that. But um, I think it's because texture packs make things a lot easier sometimes. They make the things a little bit too easy. And because of that, you kind of get a little bit lazy with your building, or you just don't build everything the same, you know, in the like as, as nicely, or you're not really, you're not trying to push yourself with it because you've got all these excellent, excellent blocks and everything, and it's it's, uh, it's very difficult to explain. Really, this is terrible. This looks absolutely dreadful. Why the hell would I choose a small willow to do first? I mean, good god. <laughs> oh. So, so many computers saying, I'm telling you, with vanilla, it's easier to place the shape of the tree with leaves first than go back and add fences. I think I'm going to do that, Nick, because, um, I mean, this is just, it's not working. Like, I've got, I've, it just looks dreadful. Absolutely dreadful. So let's just, um, start over with that. I kind of wanted it to be a little bit on the angle. I'm now thinking, no, let's just do it straight up, because if I can't, if I can't do it on the angle. <laughs> oh, man. Then, you know, what's the point? Let's, right, no, no, start again. Start again. Etch a sketch. End of the world. <laughs> type of way of doing things. Oh, man, that's terrible. Uh, right. So, yeah, absolutely dreadful, really, this whole thing. Um, so. Uh, where's my jungle leaves? There. There we are. Right, so what I need to do... At least, let's have a look at those small ones again. I'm just getting some pictures on my on my other screen. Um, they're like... These ones are just like... The, the smaller ones just seem to be, you know, really like... Little and droopy, you know? There's not really much going on. It also seems like a lighter bark. It almost looks like uh, birch, but it's not. It's like more of a more of a lighter wood than that. Not, not really lighter wood. Uh, more of a, a paler wood. Pale, like... Oaky wood thing. Oops. Is it just me, or does that look a little bit like a tiny little palm tree, which uh, doesn't have a very good texture on this? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, maybe I need to do this a little bit bigger then. Just to get that, like, starting bit. So you can always knock things out afterwards. I think the problem with it is, is trying to make it droopy without making it like really full of leaves you know um, and that seems to be the problem in this <laughs> oh no building small is not good sometimes I mean with the with the pine thing it was fine you know that, that got me started it got me to go ah yeah yeah I can do this I can do this this is just uh, dreadful. I'm going to just kill that completely. I'm going to go for a big one. Then again, when when are we going to need willows? I mean, it's only going to be like the water, isn't it? You know, if we've got it against a river or something like that. It's fine. Let's go for a big willow now. Because if I can get that shape down, then I'll, I'll kind of probably understand how it's all going to be working. And um, from that, I'll be able to build it. Right, so the middle of this plot is here. They're not actually that thick either. They don't. They don't seem to have like. I think they have quite a few roots going out to the sides and stuff. But um, generally, I don't think they have like you know a really built up middle bit. And that's the technical word. Hey, Serena Capuchin has joined. How's it going? It's come on to try and build another willow instead, hopefully, or something else. <laughs> something else entirely, probably. Um. Grr. Do more tutorials on how to build trees and terrain. I did do um, one on oak trees, uh, and that didn't do that well. Um, the World Painter tutorials, however, they're doing okay. They're not doing too bad, so I've got some more World Painter tutorials going on. Um, so that should be quite good, at least. I think we need to actually have some of these like go down, you know? So that it doesn't just like stop. So instead we got them around there, and if it's on a hill or something, it'll then look quite cool. 
and where it's naturally going to be. Some of that one as well. Yeah, because that'll, that'll look okay. That should look okay. Yeah, Whomping Willow type thing. Yeah. Uh, Fox Place, is this family friendly? Yes, I guess. I mean, it's it's one of those things. Oh, and now Nick's going to Nick's gonna build one. What's with your skin, my man? You got like a girl's skin on you. What's, what's going on? <laughs> where's your Where's your skin? I I don't understand. Oh, but yes, uh, I I guess this would be classed as family friendly. It's it's I don't know. Very strange question, I guess. <laughs> uh, yeah, well painted tutorials that are coming. So I'll explain which ones we've got. We got the mountain one will be coming up this week. I just need to edit it and finish it off a little bit. Um, so that's going to be like more more advanced kind of mountains. They are, it's looking pretty good actually. The mountains, isn't it? It's not looking too bad at all. I think I need to like do some get these to you know come out right. Um, yeah, so that's that's actually looking pretty good. Uh, I've got rivers to do. That's going to be I'm going to re have a look at rivers and you know see what's the best way of doing them and all that kind of stuff like I did before. Um, just because it. Rivers are one of those things that's quite is quite difficult, like it really is, um, but totally worth it at the same time because uh, they just work. Uh, we've got some obviously the custom objects to do. And that's why we're doing this. It's because we've got uh, I've got a lot of custom objects I want to get onto there and really have some nice looking. Um, should I have made this bigger? I'm looking at this going, this is actually quite small. But now I'm, I'm going to make one of these like small because we've got loads of loads of them we can build. So. It's fine, but yeah, um, yeah, custom objects and stuff like that. And uh, as part of that, I'll put out this as a pack when we're all done with it. So that'd be quite good. So people can just go and grab that. So you've used you've used uh, birch rather than the on the jungle. Is it just do the jungle? Is it because they're so green? Because I guess the color is actually more birch. I think that's probably what Nick's gone with is color wise. I reckon. So when Capuchin got hacked and my skin changed. Oh. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> I, I do remember actually, actually you saying about that that your, your account got hacked. It's crazy. Get two th factor authentication on absolutely everything. Two th factor and five th factor and fucking factor and all that kind of stuff. Be pretty good. Uh, Shula, you added me and st uh, Stainy to the tree plot. Yeah, yeah, you guys are both on it. Done. Well, you, you're just done. I don't know. Would you call that a willow? Do people say? Would say people say that is a small willow? Possibly. But yes, you you both are added onto it. Here we go. Got Shula run, Shula in the house. Um. But yeah, yeah, Shula, come and come and join on anyway. Come and jump onto it. So Sheila's one of the awesome donators as well, and Nick is uh, also really capuchin, should I say? Because um, it gets very confusing when you got people that have got different names on each. Uh, Sheila's one of the same as well. Because this is Aster. What is it? Ast. Asterin. Oh, yeah, Asterin. Actually, that makes a lot of sense. It's the free that free me before. I've never said it out loud. Um, <laughs> but yeah, got some quite good. Got a good nice mix at the minute. Oh, Shuli, you need to finish your plot as well so we can review that and get a video on it. So get on with it. What kind of Minecraft is this? Java. So this is Minecraft Java edition. Rather than Bedrock. That's why we got the nice shaders and everything like that. I, I, I don't think I could play Minecraft without shaders. I'm so glad that uh, like Optifine and stuff like that is just getting updated like instantly. Um, it's a shame that uh, the guy that has done Optifine, I don't think he has a, a Patreon. Pretty sure he doesn't. I can't remember. I know you can like donate because I've got the I've actually got no oh, not that one I've actually got the donator cape so for for Optifine which is um, pretty cool actually that he's added that in I think it's that's a nice little like perk for supporting him um, but only people that have got the mod can see it which kind of makes sense doesn't it you know it means that he's he's built it into the mod which is quite cool I think very cool in fact right. Shooter's going to get on with your plot. Cool, we'll go and have a look at it in a bit as well then. How about that? Go have a look. 
when I finish this willow. So you've got until I finish this willow tree <laughs> to completely finish your plot. <laughs> no, I'm joking. It'd be pretty harsh, wouldn't it? So I'm, 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 I'm pretty sure you're working on quite something quite complicated and big uh, from when I looked at it. It looked good, though. It did have a look good. It did look good. They can have a lot of these, like, bits coming down, don't they? There's still quite a lot of open space in the middle. It's just... Yeah, let's go for... Oh. Oh, there's a big gap here. That does not look good. I need to... Kind of... Do... Maybe that. It's not bad. It's just... It's not... Not great either. Something like that will do. Uh. Sheila's plot will never be done. Uh, you got eternity then. Nah, we'll be done with this soon. We'll be done with this willow soon. It's looking a lot better now that I've done a big one. Yeah, that's helped. Hell of a lot. Just need to get all these bits in here so it's like, you know, properly, properly coming down in bits. Feel free to, uh, uh, to you know, smack some leaves and stuff like that, Nick. Um, yeah, it's not looking that bad. Maybe if, uh, like an angled one, so it's like angled and going out. Uh, it's kind of willowy. Just, I'm just not sure about this bit here. I'm just wondering, should we just shove that on there? That will that'll help it, right? Just sort that bit out there, right? And maybe... Do that. Have that one up there. And that there. Oh, God. Who knows? Who knows? More on the top of it? Yeah. I think you're right, actually. It is quite... They are quite thick on the top, aren't they? Like, they're quite, you know, like a big canopy type thing, aren't they? I'm still trying to put quite a bit of airiness into it, because I don't want it to be, like, really... Res oh! Oh, well, that kind of worked, actually. That made it quite nice. Damn good cool, Irish Wanderer. <laughs> really good cool. Don't like that. No one sticking out there. That was terrible. Let's put that there instead. Hmm. It's not that bad. It looks very good from this angle. You know, this angle is it's really good. But I don't know about the rest of it. So, hmm. The Irish Wanderer, it looks great. Don't be so critical on yourself. You have to be. <laughs> this will be an official pack that we can get and give to people and stuff like that. I have the Alex skin too. Are you joking? Oh, maybe it's just we can see. Because m mine's fine. Um, Maybe the skin servers were down for a bit. Whoa. Nice. There you go, he's got that nice, um, what would you call that on your head? <laughs> uh, maybe it's just you, maybe it's just you, Nick. <laughs> maybe it's only you that can see it, how bizarre. You've broken the game. It's gotta be. Alright, that's gonna do, actually, I'm, I'm pretty happy with that one. So that's like more of like a like small to medium sized one, I guess. Um, it's just I don't think it'll be able to fit into here, so... A gigantic one. No, I'm not going to do a gigantic one. That just put it on a map and it'll just be too big. All right, well that kind of works. I'm pretty happy with that actually. Ugh. Wait a minute, this has got a different code. Willow L one. Ah, they got poplared by Bert. Is that why? Is it because that one's Bert? What what coding system are we going for here? <laughs> it's all going. It's all going to hell already. That's a Willow S, so I'm, I'm going to go with Willow L01. I'm going to go with that thing, because I did it on the other ones. Might as well. Uh, who the hell taught me English? Trees is how you spell it. Oh, have I put it on wrong? That's fine. That happens all the time. Oh yeah, you're right. I think it's because I edited it from another title and just threw it in. But you are correct. 
You are correct indeed. Let me update that. <laughs> Making trees. There we go. Cool. That one sounds pretty good. Come on, Nick. Uh, you've only built one today. I've built uh, three of them so far, so you gotta you got to at least do three of them today. That is. Um, poplars, I have no idea what that is. Oh, oak. Little oaks. I can do little oaks. I'm sure I can do little oaks. I'm going to do a little oak. What else have we got? Maple. There's a lot of maples. Elm. Birch. Beech. Aspen as well. What are these ones? Aspens. Okay, they're quite light wooded then. Never seen them before. Let's see, but that is cheating. I mean, look at that. It's like four bits of sticks with four bits of leaves. Ah, oh, so cheaty. <laughs> so I'm guessing like these ones. Have we only got a few of them then? Or is it aspen? Or is it just because there's? It's not supposed to be there. I'm guessing that that gold block. If we're blocking them off into fours. Oh, who knows? Ash as well. Okay. And, yeah, these are the Alaskan oak, uh, piney things, aren't they? Yeah. What should we do? Corsican pine. Corsican pine. What should I build now? Um, I'm thinking oak, because they're relatively easy. No, I, no, I shouldn't go for an oak, because they're relatively easy. I should go for something else. Um, I mean... Redwood. Oh, man. How are we going to get a redwood? They're huge. Oh, man. <laughs> Nick says, my bad. I know, you put the gold thing in the wrong place. Can never forgive you for that. Uh, Sitka spruce. What is a Sitka spruce? That's the first time I've ever heard of that. Sitka spruce. I mean, this is good because um, cause I would have just gone with spruce and stuff. Whoa. Okay. They look quite big. Well, they look kind of like the same, don't they? The Sitka spruce. I'm not... Oh, no, actually, no, I, I can see the differences in it. That looks quite light-barked. It's like more of a grey-type colour, so that's... Um, makes things difficult, really. God, I really need to do it. I mean, that's more like... It's maybe even acacia woody. I'm going to do a Sitka spruce. One that I've never heard of before. Redwood sapling. That's going to be the same size as... I mean, have you have you guys ever seen a redwood? Ever seen one? They are so massive. Um, in the UK, we've got a place called Centre Parks. And they are just huge. They've got a, like a redwood foresty type thing that's been growing for like, I don't know, something like 100 years or some sort of crazy stuff like that. And they're just... You just like look up and you just go... Dang. And that's it. There's There's nothing more to say about it. It's just they're huge. Absolutely huge. Um, right, okay, so yeah, sit Sitka, 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 Sitka Spruce. Sitka. Very weird. Uh, let's try and get a good picture. This is only the uh, other problem as well that you get with it. So they look quite grey. But then, apart from that, they look exactly the same as every other spruce tree. <laughs> so they're exactly the same blocks and all that kind of stuff. So, same colour, same everything. Um, is there any way to make a log generator that mines them for you in vanilla? I have no idea. No idea at all. Um, yeah, I really don't at all. Right, I'm literally going you know, to just for a couple minutes go and grab a drink. Um, should be pretty damn good. Should I put these credits on? Does that work? I just wanted to try this out. Okay, it doesn't work anyway. So, that was good. <laughs> I'm just going to... What I'll do is I'll leave you guys with... Just because I'm literally going to be gone for about 30 seconds. Um this. Oh, I can't even pause it on that. Right, back in a sec.
Oh, there we go. So I'm back. I told you it wouldn't take long. Um, so, I just want to believe we've got 120k uh, plus subs and only 12 watching. It's a bit of a difficult thing with um, uh, live streaming because I don't, because I don't do it a lot anymore. I I try to, but because I don't do it loads and loads and loads, uh, like all the time, it's very difficult to. Um, uh, and also, I don't plan them. I think if I planned them, it'd be a lot different. So if I said, "Oh, I'm going to do a stream every Monday at this time," and blah 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 blah. Um, that would have definitely worked, but because um, I don't do that, it doesn't doesn't really. It's a lot more difficult to uh, you know plan and stuff. I absolutely hate this. What is the ID value of that thing? Arr. The ID. What's the ID? What's the button for the ID thing? H. I think it's H. <laughs> there is some button to show it. I can't remember what it is. Um, right, let's have a look. Da, 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 or it's like a F something button. Palette search and all that kind of stuff. This is not it. This is not it at all. World edit reference L. That doesn't do anything. Oh well. I'll figure that out in a bit so it doesn't have that horrible orange thing. I really don't like that one. Um, but yeah, I think if I planned, I think if I planned them a lot better, I think we'd get, I'd get a lot more views on it. Um, problem is work, uh, so it's, it makes it very difficult to plan. You know, actually, what I need to do is not go out like down and stuff. I need to actually really start to create these like ringy bits on it. You know, stuff like that for sure. So I need to do something like that, right? Now I do? Okay. It's not going to take that long to do this, right? No, it's only a couple... Nick, how many trees are there left? Have you have you counted lately? <laughs> maybe, maybe what we should have done is like... I don't know, done like an event day type thing where we just... Um, we all get onto the voice chat. Actually, I could go on the voice chat if you want to, to chat, Nick, or if um, you're around as well, Sheila. Uh, I don't really mind. Actually, just thinking about it. As long as your mic's not too bad, that's the only problem. Oh, if you got a bad mic, people won't like it. I think this needs to be like small. I absolutely hate. How have I come up with that pattern of that? That is horrible. 129 minus however many we've built. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh man, that sucks. <laughs> F3 and H, I think you might be right. So, I was right with the H at least. 162, thank you very, very much, Shula. Oh man. So, was that ID that I said? <laughs> 162, right, okay, so it should be rebel 62 colon 12, I, I guess. Yeah, it is, so that's the one. Thank you very much, Shula. You've just saved the horrible orange thing on this tree. Um, without a doubt, you have saved that. That is because of you. <laughs> oh, 129, not 100. Oh, sorry, 192. Sorry, I said it wrong, didn't I? I just realised that as well. Yeah, I even tried to say it again. 192, not 129. Yeah, so 192 left. So, uh, please, come join us. <laughs> um, and help us. Because we severely need it. We really, really do. There's not really a grey kind of uh, stick at all, is there? And the, I'm not doing that one. I know what we'll do. There we go. Christmas tree. Um, no, I don't think we're going to do that. I'm just going to go with this one or that one. I think dark, because it at least hides it a little bit. And knock off that one. 
Ah, <laughs> uh, surely it doesn't have a mic at the minute. No worries, my man. No problem. Oh, I was going to go and see a plot, wasn't I? So let me just um, finish this pine off. And I'll come and see a plot that you're working on. It just looks fat on that side. It just looks really chubby on this side. That one, it looks okay. I've done this like weird... I've done this like angly thing again. I don't know why I'm doing that, but... No, I need that there. I really need something there. To be fair, that kind of works. Right, let me update the sign. Sick. Sitka. Sitka Spruce. S01. And it's by me. Ha <laughs> ha. Actually, that's quite a good thing, actually, because everybody that's actually building this um, thing... Oh, we need to switch these around. Just realised these rocks are all in the wrong place. Wait a minute. So, I, I started this plot, right? I faced all the um, signs this way. As soon as the Patreon started building, the signs are going in the other direction. <laughs> oh, man. I do like the, uh, the the small and big thing, though. That definitely works. Right, okay. Uh, Joe Tai, why am I making trees? So I'm building a big, big map at the minute um, for for patrons to basically use, and it's going to be my new big map that I'm going to be working on uh, for like the next million years. So uh, we need some trees. We need some new trees, and we need some other objects like uh, stones and stuff. I don't want to use. Um, I'm going to murder his name as I always do. You know, Lente Brienje, which is. Londo Bruges or something weird like that that I cannot pronounce and uh, every Dutch person tries to tell me you've murdered it. Um, yeah, I don't want to use his trees. I don't want to, and I haven't really seen any other really really good packs. And I was like, well, actually, why don't we just make our own pack? Because then we can just copy and paste them onto plots. So say if like I don't know um, Shula wanted some, he could just go copy them, paste them on here, no problem at all. You know, some stuff like that. Um, so Buccaneer Beaver, why am I not using Conquest anymore? Uh, main thing is audience. Uh, there's just there's not enough viewers to um, keep it going. Not enough people are around that watch just Conquest stuff. Um, it just it just doesn't exist. It's quite good for you know there's still enough for you know small YouTubers and things like that. Oh, I like this bit. It's a lot of colour in here, isn't there? It's really colourful. I quite like it though. Wow. Um, yeah, so small YouTubers and stuff like that is enough to you know sustain them, but. Um, Honestly, it's like, okay, well, I'm going to do, you know, spend 16 hours building something and you then get, like, a thousand views. And to put that into terms, uh, monetary value, that's like $1.20. So it, it's just like, yeah, this is this is just exhausting. Even though I lo like the conquest, the look of conquest is beautiful, you know? Um, oh, look, cactus. <laughs> I like this, though. I really like these in the ground. These are cool. They are very cool. I'm not so keen on the... I like this bit here. Like this path. Really like this path. Um, I'm not so sure about... I I, I, I think it's because I don't like the dirt path. I never use it, actually. But then, actually, no. You know, he has got the right... No, never mind, Shula. You have got the right mix. Because I was just thinking, like... Ah, it's too noisy. But then I just realised, yeah, this is actually, like... You have actually mixed it in properly. Hmm. It's quite good, actually. Oh, chicken. Is that chicken? What the hell is that? Cooked rabbit? I've never seen that before. That looks bizarre as anything. Looks like some sort of like head crab type thing, doesn't it? Look at that. Good god, it's like some sort of like I can see some eyes and some like teeth coming out of it. It looks terrifying. Apparently it's rabbit. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, conquest a lot of a lot of effort for, for not any real gain and uh, you know, at the end of the day, um, you know, my YouTube channel, I I like I like just building creatively anyway. Like, like I just like that, yeah? So that's the kind of like thing that, that I enjoy. Um, I like this big purple thing. I like how you plan stuff out the same kind of way I do with big purple towers. Um, yeah, creatively I like doing it, but, you know, if I'm spending a lot of time building something and, like, not a lot of people are watching it and enjoying it, you know, um, <laughs> that's the only problem with this little tower, I guess. Very, very small on the inside, but at the same time on the outside it looks fine. Um, yeah, you, you've got to think. You know, what's the what's the point anymore? You know, is that is that actually a good decision? You know, if if only a handful of people are watching it uh, and enjoying it, it, is that something that I should continue doing? And and the answer is kind of like no with it. So, um, you know, but with default and stuff like that, there's 
they are adding stuff into like 114 is the first update that I've actually gone yeah they they've actually added stuff for builders like this this is really good you know adding some really cool slabs um the loom block, I mean, that's that's a block that is obviously functional for survival players, which is really good. I actually really like the stone cutter block for survival. Um, really like that. This isn't looking too bad, by the way, Shula. Um, so I've not really been paying attention. I, like, I've been paying attention, but I've not been speaking about it. But I'm really liking it, actually. Oh, I like this. I like you've done a... I like this angle building here. That's good. That's really good. we got, like, a, a well-type cleany thingy here. Oh, they're doing dying. Okay. I think. I think that's what they're doing here. They're either washing or they're doing dying. Dire. Except, did you know the dyers would not be within the city walls? It smells bad. That's right. Because I was told off for putting mine in <laughs> on, on Hamburg and I actually had a look at it. It's the same as um, tanners and stuff like that. They're, they just don't really do that. Crazy, isn't it? Not saying that you shouldn't do that. Just continue doing that, but you know. Um, but yeah, hopefully that makes sense anyway, uh, Buccaneer Beaver. Uh, if it hasn't, just, you know, ask me another question on it, you know, or, or ask me to expand on it or something like that, do you know what I mean? Not a problem. Uh, Ed Delaney, how's it going? It's going good, my man. I'm doing good. I'm not doing too bad at all today. Um, early start this morning. That was good. Uh, well, I say that was good. Um, wasn't really. I woke up, I turned my work laptop on, and I was, uh, working. <laughs> so that was at six. So, oh man, uh, there is definitely some weird lag on the server. Actually, I've noticed that. It might just be I need to do some purging on Core Protect. Actually, potentially, I don't know. Maybe. Um, but yeah, yeah. So I woke up, did some patching. Um, did work for a couple hours and all that kind of stuff. Uh, well, I said a couple hours, you know, did my full... Well, actually, I didn't. I, I took some uh, time out, actually, and I played some Mordhau. Uh, oh, God, I got killed so badly on Mordhau. Oh, man, I, I just... Uh, it's weird. This time, the time of day, like midday, there is, there is like, nobody on Mordhau, so you've just got these, like, really high-level players. And I was like, all right, I'll do some dueling, actually. You know, kill a little bit of time. Oh, man, I just got completely nailed. I... <laughs> it was bad. So, what have I done here? Look at this. This looks terrible. Um, okay, maybe I, that's why I did that then, isn't it? You know? Um, but yeah, I got completely killed on Mordhau. I mean, seriously, just, like, slaughtered um, by a load of, like, actual really good players. But at the same time, I actually learnt a couple things, you know? I killed one person, which was which was good. Um, <laughs> and Jules. <laughs> oh, man. Oh god, horrible, hideous. How's it going, Matt Bomb? It's all doing good. Uh, the Micherino. Uh, when am I going to do Minecraft car tutorials? Never. Uh, go and check out. Go and check out a guy called Azarius Plays. He's got like a hundred thousand of them. Um, I usually just go and check out his stuff anyway. This one is next to me. I thought there was. <laughs> I could just see your shadow there. I just I hate that. Look at it. Like it's just an instant. Instantly, do you know what I mean? There's no, there's no like changing. I also don't like that you can't see a body in Minecraft. I just realised that. In Mordhauer, you can. That's why I'm like weirded out by it. It's the only reason I've noticed it because you can look down and see yourself. You know. Oh well. Um. <laughs> so, right. Yep. Shula, are you say getting killed is a new thing. I know. Oh man. I it's just so bad. I, I'm I'm getting better at the game, but oh man, there's so many, so many really damn good players, and they're they're so awkward. I, it's bizarre. It's the it's the weirdest fighting style. It's like somebody doing this, like like their screen must be doing this because they're just going all over the place, and their heads like flipped back. So then you try and poke them in the face, and they do this, and then come and swing, and you're like that. If you did that in real life, you'd just rip your muscles. All your muscles would just be gone. Um, oh, Nyx has built an elm. Don't... Oh, yeah, yeah, right, sorry, I've not been really been listening to this. Is that the elm? Is that an elm? Is that an elm? I don't know. That's an elm. I've no idea what an elm looks like, so... It's an elm. Um... <laughs> oh, who knows. But yeah, it's so, it's so... So many awkward players. 
Just absolutely awkward players. Get some lag at the minute. Sorry, guys. My internet speed's probably died uh, or dying. Uh, it seems to do this in like massive, really like massive like um, uh, things, you know. Oh, I don't know, Shula. There's there, there were so many people. Um, so the problem the problem was the dual server that I was on. There was like uh, they were all like level like forty. So they were <laughs> like I've just got to I think level nineteen, twenty, something like that on Mordhell, and they were just like so high level and very. You could tell that they've been doing it for a long time. Uh, Press tab. My connection's rubbish. It really is bad. So I apologise for the stream quality. Um, there's nothing I can do about it at the minute. Um, I'm, it's just dreadful. It's absolutely dreadful. Um, like my internet at the minute. So that's another reason I get killed on Mordhouse so much because literally my ping just goes from like 50 milliseconds and then it'll go to suddenly being like 200, 300. And I'm just like, I, I can't do anything. You know what I mean? Like it's just, it's not, it's crazy because that game you have to have a fast ping. Otherwise, like you're. <laughs> You're blocking. I think you've got to press it within that that 300 millisecond gap. So you're just like you know 50. Fair enough. You've got it. You know you've got a little bit of lead lead time to kind of work with. Nothing else though. Good God, it's terrible. Absolutely terrible. So I blame that as well. But actually, some of it sometimes really is, and some of it there are some incredible players. Absolutely incredible players on that game. But that will explain why the the this is blocks are disappearing and reappearing all that kind of stuff because. Uh, the server that's in the UK cannot doesn't know where I'm going. They go three of them now. Dreadful. Iris Wanderer, uh, the vanilla texture pack update isn't too bad. You guys in Java have a lot more than we do on Windows 10. But I have a PC uh, that barely runs YouTube. Ah, uh, right, fair enough. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what they're going to do with Java. I think they've got to. I think they should merge at some point. Um, and that means kind of getting rid of Java, um, which will be sad because of the mods. So I think the only way they can really do it is by building a proper modding API. The problem is they were talking about this for years, right? Oh yeah, the modding API is going to be in this version, it's going to be in this version, it's going to be in that. What they've actually done is they've got a scripting API instead, which allows you to do Node.js. And that's not the same. That's not the same as a full modding API at all. Um, that essentially allows you to, and, and of course they've also called, you know, changing behavior, you know, behavior packs as well. They've counted that as a modding API and it, it's really, oh wow, I've died, probably. Um, that's terrible. My own servers kicked me out because of my connection. Um, <laughs> oh god, there we go. Right, let's try that again. So, yeah, um, what was I talking, what was I god I'm talking about? Something, yeah. So that yeah, the behavior pack. So they they've kind of gone with that and gone, yeah, that's a that's a modding API, and it's like it's kind of not. It's kind of like a resource pack. I mean, yes, you get to change the behaviors of mods and uh, mobs even, and that's kind of cool. You know, that is kind of cool, but it's not adding in extra mobs. All you're doing is you're changing a creeper into say an elephant or something like that, giving them a custom skin, and making it so they don't explode. That that doesn't. That's not modding it. That's just changing existing stuff, you know? So, really annoying. Really, really annoying. Um, but I think if they did that, then, and they had a proper modding API, then it could be okay, you know? Maybe. What do you think? Sorry, Shooter. Yeah, it's dead. It just died. You probably saw it on the stream in, like, an hour later or whatever it is. Depends what, because when someone's when it's, like, really bad, it just is just really terrible. So yeah, how's it going? Cold uh, Willer as well, and a human being Earth. That's a different name. Kai's Records as well, how's it going? Um, Matt Bomb, yeah, internet was absolutely horrid, but we thankfully upgraded it from 25 to 300. I guess that's megabytes per second. But yeah, if you're on 25, no wonder. Uh, Iris wanted it looks okay to you, doesn't seem too laggy. Okay, that's good. At least the str oh, actually, it could be that, you know, <laughs> the stream is um, higher priority than than uh, talking to the Minecraft server. Right, these then go out as well. They kind of like go up a little bit. They seem to like go like that. So we're going to do some little uppy bits. But that looks terrible. 
Um, <laughs> we are going to do some little happy bits, I think, at some point. We'll get there. And Nick's technique of actually not doing the fences, I'll admit, is seemingly working. Let's do that. Yeah. No, that looks terrible. Don't do that. Okay, yeah, we'll get there and eventually. We'll have a nice tree pack and you guys will be like, never heard of these trees before. And neither will I. <laughs> That'd be quite good. Yeah, it's coming along, actually. It's coming along. Definitely coming along now. They're quite a lot... This one's very, very thin. This is a, it's a very nice, like, just generic pine. Um, but it's not really a Sitka pine. <laughs> uh, uh, pine. So I've got to kind of like use what my generic pine is and transfer it, but I quite like that, the look of it so far. I would copy and paste it, but then I know if I copy and paste it, I won't change it. I'd rather build every single one of them custom. And learn how to do it, rather than just, you know, like using stuff that we've already got. So it can be a little bit more around here, can't it? Yeah, a little bit thicker around these bits. Yes, of course, yes. Oh yes. I don't know why I'm doing a weird Sean Connery. Ah, <sighs> like what is up with that tree? Hey, it's a good tree. I like it. I like my tree. It's getting there. It's just not a Sitka Prime, uh, Sit Sitka Spruce, Sitka Prime. That sounds really like that sounds like some something from uh, from like Transformers or some sort of stuff. Yeah, the minute it's just not, it's not got the same sh the shape that I've got in the picture. I've kind of gone with um, stuff. It'll get there though. It's, it's getting there. Like add bits, take away bits, add bits, take away bits. Put stuff in here, put stuff in there. Eventually we'll get to it. It needs to be thicker at the base. That's the, that's the main thing, really. Yeah, it's a shame. I would be actually doing a lot more streams on um, Maud Howe, except that because my connection's so bad, uh, whenever I stream it, 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 it's literally so bad that it then becomes unplayable. <laughs> And the stream's also terrible quality as well. It just it gets to this like point where it's almost like um, I think it's like 20 FPS or something that I was getting on it. I was trying it out. It's just it's dreadful, which is a shame because I'm quite enjoying that. That is a game. It's like my chill out game at the minute. You know, like I'll if I just need to like I'm really stress on work. Cause work is hideous at the minute. It's just uh, I don't know what is going on. Um, well, I know what's going on. It's like lack of planning and stuff, you know, which just becomes a nightmare. But, um, yeah, like, uh, that is my go-to game at the minute. Uh, Hearts of Iron was the go-to game for me. Oh, man, that is a phenomenal game. Hearts of Iron 4 is awesome. Um, if you guys haven't tried that out, my god. It's one of those it's one of those games that you're just like, oh do I play as the Nazis or do I fight the Nazis? And you end up doing both of them. Um uh, it's more like world domination, I think, is the is the, <laughs> is the thing. It's like, oh wait a minute, I could be the British and uh create the British Empire. Alright, I'm gonna do that. And uh, and then you know it like India like, you know get you know, jumps out or doesn't jump out, they um they leave um or, or escape from your grasp and Australia does. Australia then gets a weird alliance with everything. It just—it's such a strange game, such a strange thing. Thing. Uh, so Nick's now packing and sorting stuff out, going on holiday in the morning. Absolutely, man. You, you enjoy yourself. Uh, Master Act, how does your PC barely run YouTube, but run the Conquest Reforge mod so smoothly? What do you mean? You mean like, oh, it's probably, it's more like internet speed uh, at the minute. Um, it's being in the back room. I'm literally in the furthest place, so I need to get a booster. I think that's all I need to really do. I can't imagine anything else. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, WJ, haven't played Minecraft for like a year or two. Now that I'm into it again, I uh, came back to your channel. Cool, thanks, man. Welcome back. It's one of those things, you've got to, you've got to like... You've got, oh yeah, so it's it's one of those things, Minecraft. It's got, like, this... I think it's because it's, like, Lego. Like, you can get burnt out on it. You can get, like, really kind of, like, burnt out on it. Um, but it's also, like, just got this feel to it that where you can just kind of, like, just chill out and build. It's, it's totally different than other stuff. Like, you know, if you, for example, 
feel like playing Call of Duty or Mordhau or something like that, you know, something where you're just killing people, that is quite enjoyable. Um, you can get really frustrated from it. But you don't really feel like you're going anywhere. I mean, like, some of the games, you know, you have things where you unlock weapons and all that kind of stuff, but uh, there gets a point where you've got your, like, desired build, your best build, and you're happy with it, yeah? But with Minecraft, it's more like you create this world, or you're playing survival, and you, you're just you are just surviving um, and you're building something like you know working towards something I think there's always that kind of thing uh, which is always really good uh, do I still upload those vids where I build with ultra detail and where we can see every block built um, I'm going to so um, what, I, what I did is I switched over to just doing time lapses for a little while um, but that takes so much effort so I'm actually going to do both so what I'm going to do when we've got the part of the reason I'm building this these these objects and trees and well actually a lot of people are building them uh, on the server as well so we've got quite a few people have been building them uh, Nick's been helping out today as well so he's built a couple these are all for a custom map and we're going to be building in a custom map so I'm going to be doing two things we're going to be doing a long like let's build kind of uh, series in 20 minute episodes um, and then while that's doing I'm going to be doing a time lapse of everything so there'll be like you know after it might take like 10 episodes there'll be a full time lapse and that'll be as part of a main series um, so that people get both because I was thinking about it. I was like actually There are still people that enjoy it actually. It's it's one of those things that some people like the detail like just putting something on and just building and and That, that kind of works because I remember me doing it, you know, when I when I was um, When I was just building stuff myself I was working that looks a hell of a lot better. I think that's all right now Sitka spruce Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna say that's good Let's do that Alright, sit, car, spruce, L01, that'll do. Ah. WJ, miss the old days where you made the Star Trek base and that Romanian house and stuff. Never done those. <laughs> Absolutely haven't done those ever. <laughs> How long till Nick Rage logs back in to get you to redo that tree? What's wrong with the tree? I like it. I like this tree. I actually think that looks okay. I mean, admittedly, it looks like all the other trees that I've built. <laughs> like that, this one, actually, I'm not really happy with it out now at all. But at the same time, it looks okay. I mean, it will work as a smaller one, that's the thing. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't mind that at all. I think that's okay. I think uh, it still needs tweaking. I can I can see bits on this picture where I'm trying to build it from. Uh, it's like, got oh, it needs to be more like this. How do I get my connection so much better? This is the problem, right? This is what happens. So when I'm playing Mordhau, I'll have connection like that, and then it'll just suddenly go, and I'll just get, my head will come off, uh, and I'll have the rolling camera, and I just go, I don't even know what happened. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, it's it is so bizarre. Um, I just I th I need to sort it out. I really do. I need to investigate it, and I need to sort it. But yeah, Tyson the Gold. How's it going? We've also got uh, Lieutenant Longs Long Schlong. Oh, <laughs> oh man. Uh, Matt Bomb, do I ever play Battlefield games? Uh, no, I did for a bit. Uh, Battlefield Four, I did play for a bit. It wasn't that bad. Um, it just wasn't wasn't my game. Problem with those games is same with even Mordhau as well. Mordhau is a little bit different because it's more up close and personal. So you can sometimes uh, fight a really good player and you can outmaneuver them, or like if you've got two people, you can kill them. But um, with stuff like Battlefield, you're just you're kind of running around and you just get sniped, and there'll be somebody that's just really good. Uh, will always hit you, and that's it. You know, and you can just never get anywhere. You just get so angry, um, and that's what I found because I joined it way too late, and I was just like getting my head shot every single second. But yeah, oh, I don't know. <laughs> Old PC um, ran Conquest perfectly, but it burned out with ETS2. I think he meant me, maybe. I have no idea. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What are you going on about? Do you remember the Romanian house you built? Nope, never built one. <laughs> never built a Romanian house. I don't think so, anyway. Oh, and I could have done, um, but I don't remember doing one. 
Cameron Maine, how's it going? Uh, Kylo trying to get past the shaders but can't get past the ad fly site. Um, give it a go. Right, the way the way you can do it, you can do a mirror. I haven't actually got my second screen set up on here. Give me two seconds. Um, desktop. I'll just set one up on, on here. I don't know if I can do it actually. Can I? Pressed a button. That did not. That was not what I wanted to do. Recent events. No, I don't want that. I've no idea how to do it in the, um, in the OBS uh, Streamlabs OBS. Actually, part of the problem to get back to the thing. Why would they change it? So anyway, yeah, I can't go back onto it to get um, set up a, a, a basically a scene, uh, which is really annoying. Oh, actually, I know what I'm doing. Ah. No, that didn't work. Oh, I thought I knew what I was doing. I'm obviously not at all. Um, <laughs> oh well, it's a matter. Um, yeah, I couldn't couldn't figure it out. Oh, oh, the ND ND class ship tutorial. ND ND class starship tutorial. Star Trek. I know I did a, a the, one of the uh, oh NX. Sorry, NX, not ND. Yes, I did the NX. Class, yes, to do that. And I did the Romani Gypsy Caravan thing, yes. That wasn't on Yarrowin, that was on um, Oz of Cross. That was way back in the day, Nick. That was back on. Yeah, yeah that was back uh, Oz of Cross days. That was crazy. Crazily old. Stanley's gonna build some space and rocks. But these are medieval rocks, sir. Gotta build some medieval rocks. Ground rocks. Earth rocks. Fantasy rocks. Fantasy trees. What else we got? Sick, sick of pine, redwood. Oh yeah, in there. Hmm, we're actually doing all right on the Norway spruce. I'm just having a look at mine, and I'm like, actually, I don't like that right there. That that fence. I think I've used too much fence in it. I think that's what I don't like about it. Yeah, I can have bits of it in there, just less. Less of those. Knock them out. I think that looks better. Yeah, Scott's Pine thing, I have no idea. I'm guessing they're big, because that's that doesn't look that small. Oh, why is the screen black? God damn it. Sorry guys. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah. There we go. That's better. Sorry, I forgot that I was trying to set up the desktop thing to show the guy about the shaders thing. Um, but basically go for the mirror link on Optifine if you can't get past the ad flyer. Some people have actually had that. It's really went really, really weird. Really, really weird. Um, it'll come back. Don't worry. I, I can see the comments now on the black screen. This is the only problem with the delayed thing as well, Sheila, as well. Yeah. Um, will the schematics be uh, available for these trees once they're finished? Also, stream is back. Yes, there's going to be a pack. There is going to be a pack for it, so um, don't worry about that. So that'll go on to Planet Minecraft. I think I'm going to create a um, a Planet Minecraft page for the donator server, so we can add all stuff on there. So if, if for example, like I don't know, when Shula's done with his plot or um, Stainy what is done with his plot, which he is, because I know he's done with that one, because uh, did a review on it. Um, then what we can do after that, see that's the problem, it looks really cool blue there, and then as soon as it loads on the plot, it doesn't, it just looks too dark of it. Um, but yeah, like could just upload those to like a, a Planet Minecraft page or something, but the, yeah, the pack will be, be on there when it's done. Um, so that'd be quite cool. It might be that I do, I don't know, maybe give it to the donators and stuff for like, I don't know, two weeks before or something, I don't know. But then again, donators have access to it anyway. I don't know, actually. I have no idea. It'll, it'll probably just be up straight away, I expect. Uh, maple. I haven't had a look at maple, anyway. But, I don't know. It's getting on, anyway. Um, uh, 
so. Cool. Rockwise. Rockwise, I have a feeling I won't even need these. I've kind of like built a couple of these as examples, but um, I don't think you'll ever need these type of things. Cause it's only really going to be the grey rock. From what I've seen of the terrain that I've done so far, it's only really going to be grey, rocky rock stuff. So, I mean, let's have a look. I'm just going to wander on. Stanley's just starting up MC. I was going to have a look at this. Oh, yeah, I was messing around with the uh, the snow. I need to have a chat with Nick about the snow, actually. Because <laughs> I remember how I was doing it before. I wasn't quite like this. I got the same goddamn line. And I know why. I, actually, I tried it with, I did try it with Global Operations. I'm messing around with these nice mountains here. I can't remember what side this is. Is this? Ah, oh, this is just a area in the middle. And this has actually changed a little bit, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it has. But yeah, look at those for mountains. Not bad once I get the snow right. Very, very cool, wasn't it? What render distance have I got? Far, okay. Um, so yeah, this is the custom app that I'm working on for uh, Patreon. So this will be the new world, which we'll be building. Uh, building on, even. Um, it's quite big. Still world painting it, and still messing around with the materials. The only thing that I've found is with um, vanilla. Um, from afar, the the rock just all looks the same colour, it just looks just grey, it's only when you look up close that you can actually see any sort of detail, uh, which is a bit crazy. Amplified much, yeah, this is all, it's all custom, all custom terrain. Oh, look at that, that's going to be a weird little thing. Uh, but that's what, oh yeah, Nick, um, if you're still there anyway, this is what the uh, gravel dirty thing is supposed to look like, where it's supposed to be, it's supposed to be around there, but for some reason... It ended up appearing in different places, but it should be on these like bits like here, like higher up bits. It's just hit, just did some weird stuff, really weird stuff. Oh yeah, that's the end of it. Um, so yeah, I can show you guys. No, I can't show you guys because I can't set up the thing. Oh. Oops, black screen again. Sorry, guys. <laughs> oh, no, Nick, I was just saying about... Uh, yeah, snow. Snow, snow, snow. On World Painter. That was what I was saying. I need to mess around with it. I know you said you had got some um, global operations for doing it quite nicely. Because at the minute... Uh, these aren't very snowy at all. There you go, there. Up there. So at the minute, I've got that same line, the good old line. Um, I need to mess around with it, the settings a bit. So that, I need to get some done in there. I've also tried to put in the light um, concrete as well. I'm not so sure about it yet. But I don't know. We'll see at some point. I don't even know if this is the highest point in the world, actually. 200 and... 242. That's pretty close to the edge of the world. Pretty, pretty good peak. Let's look around. Um, but yeah. Have I applied for any build teams? Nah. <laughs> I haven't got time for that. <laughs> well, hey, how's it going, Genzong? Good to see you, man. Alright, I'm just going to try and get my uh, new source. So it'll be black for a little bit. There you go. Look at that. How easy is that? Let's love it. Can I copy these? Oh, you can. Excellent. Right. There we go. That works. Gotta love it. Yep, 
Used white concrete powder as the old conquest diorite. Oh, okay, fair enough. Uh, WJ, can I explain how the Patreon tiers work? Click the link, but I don't know what the difference is between Patreon server and the Patreon world. Okay, that's, no, that's fair enough. I can update the main Patreon thing. Um, so what we've got at the minute. Discord is actually easy, so I probably need to... I need to, like, sync everything. So in Discord... Got some perks. This probably explains it the best. Um, if we go on to... There we go. So there's three different levels, really. Um, any donator um, will get the donator rank. Um, so that can be via, you know, Super Chat, which is what you can do on YouTube on live stream right now. Um, and that's any any value at all. Uh, I can't remember what the minimum is even on Super Chat. I can't come to think of it. What is it? Uh, so for me, it's one pound. Uh, so I guess it's like one door or whatever. It depends on what, what your thing is. Um, you can also do, donate via Streamlabs, or you can also be on the lower tier, which is the LD Patron tier. Um, I might have renamed that. I think I've renamed it. I don't think it's the LD Patron tier at all, so I need to update this as well. So for that, you'll get the perks of Donator Rank on Discord, uh, Donator Only Chat and Voice Chat uh, channels, which is in here. Uh, you'll get server access, given priority when answering comments and questions, which uh, kind of makes a lot of sense, because I just look in here first. Whenever I check Discord, I always look in the donated text, and while well, I look in Patreon text, then donated text, then whatever else. Um, same with anyone that's got private messages, me as well, same thing. So yeah, on the server, you'll get the donated one server roll. Um, that will give you ten small plots, and you will actually also get three large plots as well. So I've extended that to three large plots for the base donated thing, and if you want more, you get more. Uh, the Patreon role, or so this is for Patreons and also for a member. So that is if you are, if you're a member on YouTube, uh, it's roughly the same amount, um, but slightly different. Um, so for that, it's either be a member on YouTube or if you donate between five dollars and twenty-four dollars a month on Patreon, you will get uh, everything else. So you get everything from the donator perks, as you would expect. Patreon rank, um, you get so twenty-five small plots is what you got there. Um, yeah, 25 big plots, I need to actually shove that onto there, at the minute it'll just be free, but nobody's nobody's going to be able to build 25 of those, but you can also merge plots as well, that's the other idea. Um, but you also will get access to when this world, this one here, is done, which um, actually I've done a huge amount of progress like this week, uh, absolutely massive amount of progress. When this world is completed, um, then you will be able to build on it with me, so there's going to be going to set up like uh, world guard so we'll have like this capital for example over here this entire area that will be one region and we can build all of that together so that's the idea so so it's pretty good and um, that's going to be my world going forwards uh, but there you go Nick Nick spotted all these weird things this is just it's because of the slope no oh, that just doesn't make any sense actually the slope's like less than 1% what the hell did I do to make that then I have no idea. I must have pressed the wrong button when I was doing Global Operations. There's no other way of doing it. Bizarre. Because it worked around here where it's supposed to. That that does not work. Um, but yeah, it will be build all joint stuff. So there'll be uh, joint projects and there will also be um, non-joint projects. So those will all be kind of available. So the idea being that there'll be a couple things where there's a couple islands around. Uh, this big island down here is just for uh, Patreons uh, or members. And they, it's all just going to be like nice and joint and stuff, so that'll be quite cool. But yeah, the reason we're doing the, the trees and stuff is because we, we need some trees for this. I need to actually repaint it because I've put in some more hills and stuff around, uh, especially in this area here. So need to need to repaint the terrain on everything, but um, that should be pretty good. Everything that makes sense. If it doesn't, um, if you send me a private message on uh, Discord, I'll, I'll be happy to either post that, that whole uh, perks thing to you, or whatever else is. Um, but yes, I do have a Discord, uh, Darren. Yeah, just jump on. So just jump on. So for the the Minecraft server, it's um, uh, any donation to join the plot side of it. And when we get onto this custom world, then it'll be um, be just Patreon or member tier. Uh, they'll be able to have access to that if that makes sense. So should be pretty good. Cool. Hope that makes sense. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna um, head off, and I'm gonna play a little bit of. Uh, I'm gonna play a little bit of more now, and then I'm gonna probably end up getting on to more of this. But it's been really fun. Um, hopefully, you guys have enjoyed just doing this, just chilling out, and doing a little bit of the 
Minecrafty stuff. Uh, what I will do is try and get this to roll, which I don't know why it doesn't roll. So how do you get this to do it? Do its thing. I'm trying <laughs> at the minute, right? <laughs> so I'm trying to get the credits to work, which is like all these things down here. Uh, I just can't seem to get it to actually work. So I don't know why. It's live. Let me have a look. There must be a button somewhere. Let me try this. I need to get this to work. Live actions. Credit settings. I have no idea how this works. Ah, right, okay. I, I've just seen a button. I've just seen a button. I'm so confused. I'm I've literally only just switched over to um, using Streamlabs OBS. And uh, it's a little bit more <laughs> involved than I was expecting it to be. But yeah. There you go. Look at that. Look, credits now. Hey. Oh, how, how do you like that? Thank you for supporting the stream, it says. Um, so, I don't know. I, I, I think I'm going to start adding this. If I can get it to work properly, it should. I don't know if it's just the b people that have donated in the stream, and if so, it won't work very well, will it? No, that's literally it. <laughs> I'll play around with the settings on that and get this sorted. Ugh. Who knows? Who, who knows? But anyway, hopefully everyone's going to have a good day, a good weekend, all of that kind of stuff. Um, and just, you know, chill out and everything like that. But uh, it uh, should be pretty good. So, um, yeah, thank you very much for coming on the stream, guys. And um, if you want this kind of stuff as well, let me know anyway, and we'll we'll continue on. Because I'll pr I can always do some streams while we're doing trees and stuff. I mean, that's not a, not a problem. And it means that you guys keep me company while I'm... Um, doing the stuff that we need to do, really. So, to get an epic world built. And I'm going to have to do a load of brushes as well. God, I've got a lot of work to do on this goddamn map. Just realised, but it'll be all good. It'll be pretty good. So, anyway, thanks guys. See you all later.